Hello everyone, Excedra here, bringing you episode 17 of Mystical Block, a mod pack by Monaco is cool. First off, shush. Second off, double shush. Okay, and I did hear a mob. Where it? So many sheep, right here. So let's shush you, and you, and you. And wow, what a uh, really murderous way of starting. Anyway, so we're recording in December and we now have a mysterious gift, but it cannot be opened before December 25th. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just clean up a little bit and I'm going to put that in here and we're going to continue with all of the good work that we have to do. So just one second, let me just clean this stuff up a little bit what can be cleaned off that is oh i don't know why i'm doing this i should just put it in here so much simpler so let me just continue that and i did do a lot of research so i was on a business trip and whenever i had a little bit of time what i did is watch some videos to relax and do a little bit of research for this series and i discovered a lot of things that made me happy <sighs> nope not the right place okay so first off um cobalt we were working on the seeds so if i go back to the seeds we had two issues we had the honey issue right here we also have the appetite issue and we have the cobalt issue and cobalt if i look in the pack there's nothing much that we can do with cobalt there's no sieving so we can't save netherrack for it. Uh, what we really need is nether uh, cobalt ore. But there are two ways of getting cobalt ore. With Orchid Ignim, which I hate because it's so random. I don't want to do that. Or with the laser drill item. We have laser drills right there. Oh, darn it. Bye. So we have lasers. So why not use that? So let's start with that. Laser drill and then we're going to need some laser drill and or laser base so we're going to make a uh, or laser base um, pattern or laser base right here and hmm I don't know if I have enough iron ore chunk and I don't know if it's going to do substitution so let's just try that Put that in here, come back here and say, or laser. And let's just say, can I get four of you? Great. Uh, hmm. I never remember. Is it the laser base that we need for or? No, that's the mob crusher. I'm in the wrong place. So laser drill. And this is a laser. Okay, so I made way too many. Well, I made four. You know what? I'm just going to make four, eight, 12, 16 of the laser drills. So laser drills. Should probably make also a pattern for that. So laser drill. And let's make a pattern like a soap. Put it in here. And we're going to ask for 16 of those. Laser drill, 10, 20, go down to 16, and sold. So now, well, I only needed 15, but whatever. Okay, so we need to set up an ore laser in the nether. Um, yeah, I didn't show why. Let, let me explain. So if I go back to cobalt, okay. This needs to be put in a biome of nether waste, basalt deltas, warp forest, crimson forest, soul sand valley. So we're going to go to the nether and see what we can, like if we have one of those um, biomes. So if I come out right here, the biome right here is a crimson forest. So that's exactly what we need. So let me grab some bricks. And we're just going to expand a little bit this way. And, oh, I'm falling. Not a problem. Let's just get back up, grab this. 
And I want my wand because building what I want is so much better. So let's do this. Oh, I forgot the uh, the lens. Not a problem. Let's let's do one thing at a time. So I'm going to need some more bricks. Oh, I don't already have more brick. Okay, perfect. So we're going to go laser or laser base right here. We're going to go drill. Uh, oh, no, that's not the right way. Drill and drill and drill. This one's not placed properly. That's going to take a second and drill. Perfect. So I think we need to have this empty under. I'm not sure. I'm just not taking any chance. And then we're going to need to give all of this some power. So let's grab our cables from here. And we're going to like this. So this is going to connect these two and we're going to go like this. These are connect going to connect these two. Now we're going to need some flux point one two we're going to go right here and right here we're going to call this one uh, cobalt drill one surge mode disable chunk loading perfect this one we're going to call cobalt drill two and we're actually going to connect it to a network which we forgot to do with the other one Let's go back here and connect this one to a network. Okay, so target not found. Uh, nope, sorry, that's not what I wanted to do. Show, oh, it's the wrong way. I always forget that they're placed the other way around. Uh, one second, so we're going to go like this and place it like this. And we're going to break this one and place it on the other side. Basically, you need to have the holes aligned. Then I'm going to do this and put this one. Nope, I don't want to go out. And finally, last one, like so. All of these should now connect. Yes, laser drill, laser drill, laser drill, laser drill, and or laser base. But now we need to go back home and get the proper lens, which I completely forgot. Let's come back over here. And let's look, the cobalt was, what was the lens that we need? We need a blue laser lens. So we need a lens, lens, like this. And we're going to need some blue dye, blue dye right here. And then I believe we can just craft these together. So this and this, voila. So let's go back home, uh, back home, back to the nether, sorry. And we're going to put this down and we're going to just insert. Perfect. And we already have one. So this is going to go into a foundry or we're just going to melt it. That's two ingot. Oh my God. Give me the next one. Come on. You know what? You know that I love my cheating. So watch a flowing time and pedestal perfect we're going to put those right here and oh sapphire <gasps> by the way sapphire is something that we need for the sapphire seed i just didn't think that we were going to get one of these right here a uh, second cobalt ore so we're good for the cobalt uh, third one, don't care. You know what? I'm just going to let that continue. We're going to come back in a moment. So let's go make our cobalt seed because we need to get that started ASAP. So if I come in here and I put my two cobalt ores, uh, just make sure, yeah, nothing that should mix with it. That's going to give me my four cobalt. And that's what I was going to say. I need appetite, okay? The appetite seed needs appetite. And how do I get appetite? By appetite ore, but that's not laser based. But, 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 I can get appetite ore from, hmm, uh, pulverizing, new, no, 
I want to get Appetite Ore from pulverizing, well, Appetite Ore that I can get, but Tin Ore. So this Tin Ore, nope, that's not the right one, sorry. Um, arr, let me just search again. Tin Ore, nope, Tin Ore. So there's this Tin Ore right here. And if I take this Tin Ore and I push it through an induction smelter, I have 75% chance of getting appetite. How do I get this tin ore? With a laser drill, with a light gray laser lens in any biome. So there is a chance that I'm already getting that in the other place. Let me just come over here. This is the cobalt. Let's just hit this. We're gonna do it four times. We're gonna get four ingot and we're going to get our first cobalt seed. And what we're going to do is we're going to place that immediately to start producing a cobalt essence so that we can get more cobalt because there's two more things that we can do with cobalt so cobalt seed is uh the imperium essence so right here imperium imperium essence i'm going to grab one two three four of you and then i can just go and make that i'm trying to prioritize what's going to take the longest so that's why i'm starting with this one, two, th three. Wait. Where's the fourth one? Yo. Oh, how? I I don't know. Let's not ask any question. We found it. Don't know how it got there. Probably throw it, threw it on the ground. So let's do that. Do this, and we're going to get our first cobalt seed right here which also went in the wrong place so let's grab this and we're going to come back over here and this is the next one so let's just put it right here and we want a lot of this so watch of flowing time again and pedestal again and let's just get this activated asap i'm gonna put it right here oh don't know why there's two do this. Great. So this should start going crazy. And if you remember, I set up an overflow chest last time because I was tired of this issue. And now because of the overflow chest, I can grab this. And am I getting any of these seeds? No, it doesn't matter. Right now, I'm just going to put that in a chest right here. Uh, right here. And ender pearl essence okay so nope i didn't set up ender pearl in any of these so let's just come down here and this and the wither skeleton essence so i'm just going to set this right here and this right here perfect so those should be taken care of right now um I don't know if any of these matter I i'm gonna come back and check that later because yeah let's just grab it let's just do this is there a way to insert those in here what i'm thinking is do i not have void on every single drawer yes i do which means that they're not being voided let's do this and continue and then we can get the signalum and the sulfur signalum sulfur and let's see if these will insert now so we still need Electrum right here and Wither and Coral. So Wither and Coral and we're already out of drawer space. This is crazy. So let's just grab these and these 64 I'm going to make into more Cobalt. So like this, we're going to get <clears throat> a lot more Cobalt. Perfect. Uh, let's just go back to the nether. I want to see if I have more sapphire and more tin and more ruby because ruby is also another one that I need. Oh, ruby ore. Perfect. Uh, sapphire ore. Perfect. So we've got the sapphire seed. Oh, I should have left that in there because... Oh, that's sad. Sapphire. Got one tin ore, but that's the wrong tin ore. Is it? Yeah, I think it's the wrong tin ore. I think it's the one. Oh, it might work. So, osmium, platinum, bauxite. You know what? Let's just grab all of this. 
Um, yeah. Putnam. Oh, I've got 8 tin. So basically, it's the ruby I should not have taken out. Because if you still have a space for the ruby, it's going to appear. That being said, ruby can be gotten by a red laser lens in any biome. So I'm going to... Oh, do I have red dye? Yes, I do have red dye. So I'm going to turn around, grab this, and I'm going to go... You are now a red lens and i'm going to put you back in here and already we have a second ruby so the ruby we need four uh gonna wait just a tiny bit nope i'm gonna wait another minute while i take a sip of my beautiful beautiful drink and one sip equals two ruby so I'm more than happy we can leave this place and technically that's three more seeds. So now if I come to my induction smelter and I put the ruby ore, that's seven ruby. If I put the sapphire ore, that's 16 sapphire. If I put the tin ore, that's eight appetite. I couldn't ask for more. You know what? Let's just put all of this through just because why not? Nope, platinum doesn't go. This went gold went uranium doesn't go lapis goes copper goes iron goes no uh yes and does bauxite go no okay so these were just going to throw in the system so let's throw all of this in the system we're going to keep four ruby we're going to keep four sapphires and what was the other thing that i needed i needed appetite so let's grab four of those so these are going to be made into seed with what? Into seeds with Prudentium. Ruby is going to be made into seed with Imperium. And Sapphire is going to be made into seed with Perfect. So I need the uh, Prudentium. I'm going to need four of you. Just going to grab one block that I'm going to transform. And I'm going to put back the rest. So one, two, three, four. Put that back. Then I'm going to need the super, uh, the superium. No, the OMG, the something, something, something. Let me just check again because I just read it five seconds ago. The Imperium. Wow, Imperium. So I'm going to need one, two, three, four. Nope, and another four right here, and voila. So that's going to be two more seeds. So you and you. One, two, three, four. Two, three, four. Hit the button. Grab the next one. So it's going to be one, two, three, four, one. Oh, one, two, three, four. Hit the button. And then the sapphire, same thing. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I'm so glad that I found the laser solution because that saves a lot of things. And I've got a little surprise for you guys. I've also figured the honey solution. So let's grab this, this, and this. And we're going to go and set these up also. So if I come here, one over here, one over here. And that's probably the last seed I can set up for now. I'm going to need more. Oh, no, 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 no. I've got all of these that I can set also. So let's just go back right here where I'm going to go to the overflow chest. And now we've got Sapphire. We've got Appetite. And we've got uh, Ruby. We've got Saltpetter. We've got Cobalt. We've got Appetite. So I'm going to need a couple more quad drawers. So quad drawers. Oh, no. Sorry. Drawers. Let's do this. Let's get some void. Let's get some upgrades. The emerald upgrades, of course. Upgrades. Perfect. And let's just get a key. I, I know I probably have one in my backpack, but oh, no. I'm going to have to grab the one from my backpack because apparently I never duplicated it. And I'm going to put that in my hand and I'm going to go one, two, three, four, five. And then I can just go 
this and this. And yes, I did hear a mob, but I'm not worried. Unless it's the one-shot mob from last time, which actually, well, it wasn't one-shot. It two-shot in me, so I guess it's not scary. So this and this. I'm just going to finish it. Ah, uh, I should have taken this off of my end. What is the wrong thing in here? I think that's the wrong thing. And now I'm going to grab and lock. Unlock. Grab and... Grab and lock. Oh. I got it. Perfect. So now I control all of this in here. I need Sapphire Seed right here. And now these are maxed out. And these are maxed out. Perfect. So I can put all of the rest here and I think I've addressed everything. Let me just come and check. Nope, Ruby Seed. So Ruby Seed I'm just gonna put here. Voila, so that's taken care of. Let's just show, I'm gonna learn my drawer key for next time. This, this, okay, these can't go in there. So let's just put them in the other, oh my God, these mobs are so annoying. I've got some uh, spawning problems over here. Great, that's taken care of. I'll take care of the spawning issue in a time lapse, I guess. Like, I don't want to waste that time. Okay, so if we go back to the seed, we've got a couple of things resolved. We still need to do the honey. Uh, we've got graphite is an uncraftable seed. We've got mana steel. So mana steel is going to be botania, which is going to be one of the next episodes. We've got refine, which is mechanism. We've got experience which i need to go to the end we've got hop graphite which is mechan uh, not mechanism that's uh immersive engineering steel from uh mechanism fluorite from mechanism refined from mechanism elementium from botania so we need three more things to do then we've got terra steel from botania epatazone queen slime and menulin those threes are made from cobalt so we're going to take care of these so maniulin needs maniulin ingots, and maniulin ingots is made with netherite scrap and cobalt. So if I come right here and I say netherite, netherite, oh, scrap, yeah. So I scrap that, and we're going to make four of these because we only need four. So one, two, three, four, and put some cobalt ingot. I said we needed only four, but I guess I'm like, nope, let's do all of them forever. So this is going to be the Supremium Essence, I believe. Yes, all three is going to be Supremium. So I'm going to need five, uh, four, eight, twelve Supremium. Supremium, uh, one, and I'm going to need 11 more. Perfect. And with that, so let's go and make the maniulin. So one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Put this and let's make the seed. And then I can get rid of that and grab that seed. Perfect. Now, you know what? Let's get rid of these things also. I just want to try and keep my system as clean as possible. So, no, no, I'm going to keep those, no, no, and no, perfect. So, the next seed, if I go back to the seed system, we did this one. The next one is the queen slime. Queen slime needs queen slime ingot, and queen slime ingot are made in an induction smelter with cobalt, gold, and magma cream. So, if I come over here, magma cream, I'm going to need two, one and two, gold, I'm gonna need two, gold, one and two. We're gonna go and put that in the induction smelter again. So you, you and you, four queen slime ingot. And if I do this again, I'm just going to go look. The next recipe is epatazone. And epatazone is obsidian and copper. So I need two obsidian, four copper. So obsidian, one and two. And then I need copper. One, two, three, four. And put that in there. And voila, for a patazone. So now I can just grab these and these, and that's going to be two more seed. 
four, one, two, three, four, and the prosperity seed, of course. <clears throat> and then the queen slime. One, two, three, four. Two, three, oh my god, three, four, so many mess click. Voila. So if I go over here and get rid of these, now I have a queen slime right here and an apatazone right here. I'm just going to go and put these in the next setup right here and put them in drawers. So remove, 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 and one, two, three, and there's these are all in the fast production place. Okay, I don't need you. So now I can just go and get rid of these things right here. And uh, so I made too many laser. I thought the laser were going to take way longer. So Epatazone, Maniulin, Queen Slime. So let's put those in here. One, two, three. And then let's just put the seeds, seed, seed, seed. Again, same thing. Let's go one, two, three. Oh, these were not upgraded. So now I need the upgrade. So upgrade, let's grab a stack of these and void. Let's grab a stack of these. And what I usually do is I go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, one, two, three, four. Then I put a void because if you put the void in the beginning, you might lose some resource. Great. So now everything should be good. We should be good for all of the seeds that are remaining. Since we're not going to need the laser, I'm just going to throw these in here. And then we can look at the seed and we got three more done. So really now we need Botania. So this is going to be Draconium, a Draconic Evolution, which is probably one of the last thing we're going to do. Then we need the Botania for the Elementium and Terra Steel and um, what's the other one? Mana Steel. Then we're going to need Mechanism for a couple more. And we're going to need Immer Immersive Engineering just for the up Graphite. That is going to be a bit annoying. But the last one we have is Honey. And I did some research and OMG, I... Bees? are a vanilla Minecraft thing. So what we need is some birch sapling. So if I come over here and I do this, I can teach my system to make birch sapling. And you know what? Let's just, just do that and search for it again, birch. And we're going to take a stack of birch sapling and we're going to take a stack of bonamila, like so. And what you need to do is grow uh, sap birch sapling and we need to grow them near flowers Ooh, goodbye rabbit goodbye rabbit now let's get rid of this and this is kind of a low chance unfortunately so what we're going to do is just do this and run around and did we get a we didn't get a single one so we're gonna go kill 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 and destroy And we're going to go again. One more here, one more here, one more here. And run. We can use the bone meal or run. No, that's why I don't like using the bone meal. Bone meal. Bone meal. We didn't get a single um, beehive. Let's kill all of that. And these don't despawn fast enough, which is kind of annoying. One, 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 and oh. not a single either. So it's a 4% chance. So technically on a 4% chance, after 25 trees, we should get one. But um, yeah, <laughs> statistics are statistics. And even though they're statistic-y, the statistic doesn't always equal what you expect the statistic to be. And yeah, that was like a very um, advanced sentence made to confuse everyone, especially myself. So let's put one right here, one right here, and one right here. And let's run again. Nope, nope, and nope. And 
from what I was looking at, I think it can be done with other saplings, but from what I was looking at, there seemed to be a higher chance with the uh, birch sapling, but I, I don't know. It's not like I was able to test it. I was in a place where I didn't have access to uh, my gaming computer. I only had access to a work laptop, and for whatever reason, I still do not understand, uh, work seems to front upon installing uh, Minecraft on a laptop. That being said, mod packs on a laptop do not work really well. So I was hoping to do this with you guys because I wanted to show you, but this seems to be taking a bit longer. I'm going to try like two or three more iteration. And if it doesn't work, I'm probably going to have to time lapse. Oh, and voila, we got one. Okay, so important thing. Huh? Okay, so we've got bees. Now we're not going to do anything about it because I don't want to lose that beehive. So we're going to remove this and this and this and you know what i did grab some uh birch leaves i'm just going to rebuild the tree like so and like so so this is kind of a fake tree but I'm just sad that I almost destroyed it. Thank God I didn't get rid of my bee. And what I'm going to do is I'm, of course, going to go with the very cheaty watch of flowing time and pedestal again because I do not want to wait for this. And I'm going to need some shears because that's how you get the honey. So shears. And let's put that right here. Okay. Okay. I also think, but I'm not sure, that we need to have some uh, campfire under. Like from the research that I was doing, it was saying something about the camp. I think the campfire makes it so that it, they do produce honey. I'm just not 100% sure. I'm just going to do what I found in the research to make sure that this works. We're going to go sleep because I don't think that bees produce honey during the day. And we really just need one honey because you know what honey is um emciable so let's come right here and i guess we're just gonna have to wait a little bit i think this changes color when it has honey in it so let's wait a little bit watch a flowing time doesn't seem to be doing anything in this case i wonder if i go poppy and I put more flour, is this going to help? No, it's not producing any yet. Let's just wait a little bit. Oh, that bee was very funny. I don't know what happened to it. It, it kind of exploded slash jump. You know what? I'm just going to remove those in case. I don't know if the top needs to be clear. I don't know. Like, I've never really played with honey in any mod pack, like in any Minecraft other than one that had a bee, a mod. So I do know that this is supposed to get me honey. Just don't know when. Lou, you go in and you go out, but you give me no honey. You are bad bees. Give me honey. Let's go. I'm going to wait a little bit more, but I'm slowly kind of running out of patience. Let me just, while I'm here, clean up a little bit. Oh, rabbit's foot. So now we're going to teach our EMC how to make rabbit foot, which means if we need more rabbit's foot, now we'll have infinite rabbit's foot for, um, infinite rabbit foot for things and stuff and all of the things. Sorry, rabbit's foot for... I'm searching for my words so much. Uh, rabbit foot for when I decide to uh, make looting. Oh, got it. Perfect. So now we have honeycombs. So we can leave here. Uh, you know what? I'm going to stop you because one, you didn't seem to work. And two, you're going to affect my frame rate. Okay. So now that we have honeycombs, honeycombs, we can just go here and teach them to our system. And now if I say 
honey combs i can just grab stacks upon stacks of it okay so if i go back to the honey seed we need honey agglomeration and honey agglomeration it needs honey bottle and honey bottles are made with honey essence or honey block or in a solidification chamber with honey and you get honey by centrifugally separating so let's just do a centrifugal separator centrifugal separator right here should be able to craft that outright nope i need a compass first so now compass is taught i can make this and go right here and put some honeycombs in here oh this is using a lot of power so that's i'm going to need 10 of these I need a full bucket, I believe. Perfect. So now let me grab a... Why can't I put this in? Oh, I can. So bucket. And let's grab a bucket like so. And let's grab the honey. Well, you're not letting me pick up the honey. So let's grab the solidification chamber. Don't know if that's gonna work, but I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna put the solidification chamber right here and I'm gonna set that to export to the right. Perfect. And then I'm going to do glass bottles like this, three glass bottle. And because it is EMCable, we can just do that. And then I can grab a honeycomb, honey. I'll grab a fourth one of those and I'll grab one, two, three, four. I'll grab five. No, I don't know why I grabbed five. This is a bad math because I'm going to do this and this. And I'm going to make any agglomeration, but I'm going to teach any agglomeration to my system and grab it again. Agglomeration. One, two, three more. And oh, not five. I just need four. And these need to be put with Prudentium Essence, which I can have easily right here, Prudentium. <clears throat> Four, let's get rid of the bucket. Let's get rid of the bottle of enchanting. Let's grab a Prosperity Seed. Let's get rid of the shears and voila. That's going to be the next seed that we were missing. One, two, three, four. And now for the other seeds, we basically just need to go and um, we basically need to immersive engineering for one seed uh, Britannia for like four seeds I believe and then we're going to need mechanism and a lot of mechanism for five or six seeds so I'm going to come right here and put that one right here and then I'm going to go and grab whatever overflow gives me here honey and honey we're going to put these right here and here and voila so we only have the seeds the the only seeds that we have left needs us to progress through the pack so here's what i'm going to do now we need those shulker seeds um where are they no they're not here okay so the shulker seeds are the only one that are in a weird place basically the shulker seed are right nope not here they're right here so now I'm going to, like, yes, this episode is much shorter, but I'm trying to keep things more related to one pattern. I'm going to go in the nether. Oh, yes, one last thing. Sorry. I'm going to go in the nether and I'm going to kill shulkers because I'm going to need to kill how many shulker is it? 40, I think. I'm going to need to kill 40 shulker and I'm going to kill those shulker while I'm holding these experience capsule in my inventory and also i'm going to be holding some uh, soul capsule so soul oh right here so soul jars four of them because i need to fill four and what i want to do is i'm going to grab a solium dagger and these solium dagger they can be crafted to be a tune so this one's passive a tune this one's hostile a tune uh, what we want is a hostile attuned dagger because with a hostile attuned dagger, we're going to grant additional soul from hostile creature. Hopefully, it's also going to give us more experience. I'm going to need two solium gemstone, 
So solium. So two solium ingot, and then we need some solium gemstone. Solium. How do we make the gemstone like this? Gem stone. Yeah, I want two of you. Give me another one. One, two. Perfect. And then what was the rest of the recipe? We need it to be uh, soul skeleton, zombie, spider, creeper. Okay, so I'm going to come right here. I'm going to put one in here. And let's grab skeleton, zombie, spider eye. And I don't remember the next one. So let's do these one first. So spider eyes. That's going to give us a spider soul jar. Perfect. Then we're going to make the zombie soul jar. Perfect. Then we're going to make the skeleton soul jar. And I don't remember what the last one was. So let's do R on this. And we also need a, nope, that's not the right one. We need a zombie creeper. So creeper. Okay. So let's just come right here, push those and grab some creeper head. So one, two, three, four should be enough. And we're going to need some soul jars. Soul jars. One, oh, one, two, three, four. Okay, so now let's just do the creepers. Perfect. And that should be good. So let's do this. So one, two, three. No, that's an empty one. We need the skeleton one. And then we need the psyllium ingot and the psyllium gemstone and the psyllium dagger right here. And let's infuse that one. And we now have an hostile attuned, yes, right here. Okay, so let's go to the end, through the cake. And that completed a quest, which I don't know why it didn't complete before. And now we just need to find the uh, portal. Oh, it's right here. And we're going to need some ender pearls. Ender. Let's grab this. And let's show one through. And now basically we have to find shulkers. Uh, I don't. So if you remember, I did play a little time lapse where I was looking for shulker and they were unfortunately not that easy to find. But basically, I'm just going to fly around the end in a time lapse and I'm going to take however time it takes to find an end city or to find some shulkers. And once I do, I'm just going to be killing shulkers until... Okay. Quest completed. Don't know... Oh, I think we're going to be able to kill our first shulker right here. Are there shulkers in here? I don't know if these have shulkers. I don't think so. Are there shulkers in here? Please let me fall in the hole. Nope, this has zero shulkers. So that was one of the problem that I had when I was first exploring this place is that shulkers are not because of all of the different biome that this place seems to offer. Shulkers don't seem to be as easy to find as they should. Like usually the end is full of shulker. You just need to find an end city or an end... Uh, boat or something like that but because of all the other mud packs in here they're just not as easy to find so i'm just going to fly around and i'm going to find some shulkers and i'm just going to kill 40 shulkers and hopefully what i'm hoping is that not only will i get my four soul jars of shulkers i will also be getting the experience and if i don't have the experience by the end I'm just going to kill more mobs until I have the four experience capsule because that's going to be the last two seeds. And what I'm going to do is that in my next episode, I'm going to 
I think I'm going to get started on mechanism. I don't want to do Batania quite yet. I just, I'm, I'm putting it off. You know what? There's a good chance that I do Batania just to get rid of it, but no guarantee. And then we're just going to probably grab the next uh, quest in line, the next quest line, and just we'll do them in order and just power through and figure out how to get every single one done just like this one like i'm happy i did this because i i unless you guys didn't know how to do honey i showed you how to do honey that's what i'm trying to figure out so i'm just going to do the research and get rid of all of them i know that the reason i'm not sure i want to get into mechanism is that even though i love mechanism i know that mechanism is going to be two or three episode because again it's very deep and we're going to have to get into fusion and we're going to have to do the fusion reactor and the fission reactor and the whatnot. It's just that with EMC, it makes things easy, but it's not ideal. And I, of course, have ideas and ways to, uh, I don't want to say cheat it, but yes, of course, cheat it. I have some ideas of how to make something simple because we are at the point where we can make creative item. So I might just start like, I don't want to have any power problem anymore. So I'm probably going to unlock creative power. And once we unlock uh, all of these gases and whatnot, I'm just going to do the work to unlock the gas and set it up. And then I'm going to probably make chemical tanks for each so that I have infinite of everything. OMG, we've been talking for 10 minutes and I still have not found a single shulker. This is not looking good how are shulkers so hard to find uh i don't know are there shulkers in this uh mod pack again might have to do some research but like i said i'm gonna go in my time lapse and i'm gonna search for those in my time lapse that's why i wanted a bit of a smaller episode because i don't know how long i'm gonna be time lapsing for those shulkers before i do that though i'm just gonna go down i want to check one last thing with you guys if i go right here and i search for shulker shulker spawn egg i still need shulker fragment for that huh yeah i need shulker essence so i i was like can i make one because once you make one you can probably make more than one and i thought maybe then i can make a spawner for them but uh, apparently, I don't think that's going to be doable. Hmm. Okay, so like I said, I'm also going to consult the map once in a while because when you do the map, usually... So what I usually do... Oh, see? I think this might be a city. Um. So I need to come back. Can I put a waypoint? Add waypoint here. And I'm just going to go back. So sometimes what looking at the map is just easier because the map gives you a better overview of things that are far away. Oh, yeah, perfect. So let's kill one shulker together just to make sure everything's good. But that's like that's an easy way of finding things that are harder to find. So hopefully there's going to be a shulker in here. Ho ho, not just one. And, haha, 1.5. Oh, the flight. So I'm not getting teleported because of the flight. Like, because we have, like, a great flight mechanism, this is not a pro... Come on. Oh, I can still kill that. Okay, so that's working. And that's basically what I'm going to be doing in my time lapse. It's probably going to take more than one end city. So unfortunately, I'm going to have to find more of these. But I was able that I was able to show you one and also show you the mechanism by which I'm going to find these. Because that's really the way that's the easiest to do. You, you look at your map and based on the map, you find like where they are and you just fly to like you put yourself a waypoint and you fly to them. So I think that's all the shulker there was. Oh, that's not a lot of shulker. You know what? Give me two seconds. I've never seen this. So what is in here? Uh, 
Uh, what are those? <gasps> I've never seen these purple -pur golem, but they're cool. And I made a mistake. It's not the end of the world, but now I'm going to have a... No, no soul jar. Did it put some in my shulker? So 750? I don't... Oh, I don't think so, but... Uh, let me just check around. There's so many mobs in here. Look at the map. It's red all over. I don't want to kill any of these. Oh, these are so cool. Never seen these structure before. Huh? Himalite spawner? What is a Himalite? Uh, yes, please. Just give me the spawner. Getting spawners is good because we're going to need spawners for We might need spawners for other thing, but no what we really need is shulker So I'm just going to take a quick look around. Oh, let's just get out of here This is kind of a maze Okay, yeah, so this is big and it's a maze, but oh, there's another one right here. No, these are the shulker less one So these are the structures that do not have shulker so if I go and do the same thing and look at the map, uh, so no, 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 no structures anywhere. So basically, like I said, I know I'm repeating myself, but I got to go. So I'm going to be looking for structures and inspecting structures until I kill my 40 shulkers. How many have I killed right now? 12%. So 12%, 10% is four. That's probably five. But anyway, so that's what I'm going to be doing in my time lapse, and now it's really time to go toward the time lapse. So I'm going to remove the uh, um, waypoint, and I'm just going to make sure I don't know where I'm looking. So I want to look not toward the yeah. So this way. So that's what I'm all. That's all I'm going to do. I'm just going to fly around and kill shulkers so it's probably going to be an hour of recording i'm guessing because of how rare these things are but that's what i'm going to do i'm going to kill shulkers and once we reconnect when i when i come back in the next episode we'll have the shulker seeds and then like i said the more i'm thinking about it even though i'm not happy about it the more i think i'm going to do botania because I think I can clear Batania in one episode. Like if I just spam the heck out of it, I might be able to do Batania in one episode. And then I can move on to the other quest line. Guys, thanks for watching. And I'll see you in the next Batania episode. Bye now.